Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, Morby, and I'm back again with another super easy and fast guide to add to that 100% list. Today, I'm showing you how to beat Don't Starve in under 15 minutes. Now, for this fast completion, you will have to have access to a PC as we'll need to play it on there as opposed to the Xbox. This is because you cannot open the developer console on the Xbox and this is integral to the quick completion. You will also need the Game Pass Ultimate to play on the PC. Shout out to Acid Rain for the initial heads up. I saw his comment on True Achievements and this is how I found out about this. Now, this is probably the fastest 100% that I've done on my channel yet. If you're like me and love hunting achievements, come follow my Twitch as I'm completing them over there all the time. It's twitch.tv forward slash Mr. Morvy. You will need to have to copy and paste a few codes into the console, but don't fret. They are all in order in the description below, as well as links to my other content. So yeah, let's jump in and get them quick achievements. Okay, once you have the game downloaded, you're going to want to boot it up. Go to the new game and make sure you click the DS box so it doesn't load up the DLC. Let it generate the world and once you're in, this smooth dressed gentleman will appear. Don't worry, we can skip him and send him on his way. First things first, we're going to need to find out what button opens up the developer console. For me, it was the app button. But I believe usually the default button is the hashtag button. So try both of those and if not, give a few others a try. Eventually it will pop up like it does on my screen now. From here, all we need to do is enter three codes. The first code I'm going to enter is for God Mode. This one isn't for an achievement, but will help us ignore the surroundings and get to them achievements a lot quicker. All the codes I talk about in this guide can be found in the description down below, so you can easily copy and paste them while playing the game. Once we have God Mode on, we can begin collecting them achievements. Open up the console, but this time paste the code that I'm doing now, and this will unlock everything. Remember, the codes are in the description below, and this one will give us our first eight achievements. Now, all we need are two more. Wait until they all pop, and then open the console again. This time, we're going to use the code to give us all of the recipes. Now we have the ability to build whatever we like without having the materials. So next we are going to open up the science panel to the left of the screen. It's the one that looks like the atom symbol. We are going to scroll to the bottom of that list and we are going to find the Accomplish Shrine. This will give us the secret achievement, look on my works ye mighty. Okay, this might be a little strange to hear but we are on our final achievement. It's a little bit of a grind, but it's going to be an easy one. It's called And Despair. For this achievement, all we need to do is interact with the Accomplish Shrine 725 times or let the fireworks go off 29 times. The easiest way to do this is go up to the shrine and hold the space button to interact with it. Then find a heavy object to hand. I use my Xbox controller. Simply balance one of the triggers on the space bar and it should be enough weight to hold it down. Now you can go do something else, go make a sandwich, go get a drink, because this one's going to take around 10 minutes to get. So rather than holding on to the space bar, just hold it down and just check on it every five minutes. You will know when you've done enough as you'll get the message, only my friends could see me now. And this will unlock our final achievement. And that is the end of the guide. If I helped you out in any way, please let me know down in the comment section. If you'd like to see more, please hit that subscribe button as I'm close to 300 subs. I have some other super quick guides coming out in the next few days, so keep them eyes peeled. But until next time, guys, I've been Movie, and I'll see you later. Peace.